Standing room only. Yeah, I see you guys have a lot of people there. All right, so game one to Fetter. Now let's see a little bit of your play here, a little bit more deliberate. Yeah, I'll tell you what, that table is, it seems really, really slow. They're hitting the ball super easy. I don't know. It seems like it's uh, really slow. It does All right, look like so it's playing just a, gonna... It does look like it's playing a bit slow. Yeah, it's playing a little slow. All right, so Fetter just went on and moved that ball. Not much for Efren to do, try to get it back on his side and maybe go forward. Um, he could thin the seven and put him up table. That would limit Fetter's ability to move. Um, looks like he's going to take this two ball and maybe put him behind the 15 instead. Oh, no. He got he got lucky. He was trying to go upward, and he got lucky. I don't know if he left a peak at that four. But uh, I don't think the 12 banks. It looks like it's a bit too low on this table. At least from where the cue ball position is. Um, I don't know. I think he's got to maybe, uh, kick. No, maybe not kick the four. You know, I don't know. I'm not sure. Maybe take a kick at the seven and be willing to take a foul here. Oh, he's going to bank at this ball. Yeah. Yeah. No, no. I, w I don't want to say that I'm wrong because I don't feel like I'm calling the wrong shots compared to... <laughs> The speed play. Uh, I'm going to have to adjust my commentary <laughs> for the speed play. <laughs> all right. So, all right. I would, if I'm Efren, I'm banking the four. I bank the four and let my cue ball go into the 15, clearing them both. And that's what he's doing. Well, went a little high on the pocket, but in any case, he's got him trapped now. Um, Looks like Fetter's going to go ahead and uh, take a bank at the long railer and leave Efren doubled up. His cue ball is going to go to the left under those balls, the two, the t the two ball and stuff over there. All right, so he's dared Efren to shoot at this combo, but Efren actually has a gate if he wanted to shoot at it. That four ball is there to act as a gate. So if he could hit it somewhat accurate, he could actually shoot it. But a uh, normal one-pocket player is probably going to just cross the 15 out. You don't want to leave the cue ball down there, so you just want to get the 15 out of there and go up. There you go. Uh, that landed a little funny, and he's left Fetter a clear look at the four to clear them out if he wants. I like shooting it with a lot of top English and uh, making sure the cue ball sticks and letting that four clear the uh, 15 and the seven. Oh, he banked at it. Keeping it, he's keeping it speeded up here. He's giving every chance to win a game. So, all right. So you got the, you got the four sitting there. You got the 15, um, the seven eight are open in the middle of the table, and so are the five six just below it. Easy bank on the thirteen and the five will go. So he's got all eight sitting right there. All right, so that's two balls. He may go ahead and shoot the six now and clip the thirteen away from the rail. That way he doesn't even have to bank one. And he can use the thirteen to hold the cue ball, maybe. No, he didn't even try that. He just just playing shape. All right, so he's going to go get the five now. Play shape for the five or the five and the one. Yeah, now back to the eight or three, whichever one he likes. And 
make that look easy. All right, so going to the one now off this eight ball. <clears throat> oh, he hit the one. That was a mistake. He was not trying to hit the one. He may go ahead and shoot at the 11. If he makes it, he'll have a shot on the three to win the game. And the balls are out of play a little bit where it's okay to shoot it. I don't think Feder can run out easily from this spot if he were to miss from here. So uh, I'm going to shoot this bank. Jen. And he put the top English on to stick it back there. All right. So beautiful shot by Efren. And this three ball makes that an eight and out. Good shooting. One, Nicely one. Nicely done. The great, the great move, the best move in uh, one pocket, right? <laughs> All right, we are being joined by the man himself, Rodney Morris. Hey, Rodney, uh, how are you doing? I'm good, I'm good, yeah. Well, uh, table brings back a lot of memories. This is what I grew up on in Hawaii. Same kind of cloth, too, Stevens cloth, slow cloth. It's awesome. Yeah, I was just I was just complaining about that, saying how slow it looked like it was playing. <laughs> yeah, yep. So I was playing a little tournament earlier. I just lost in the final. We had a little nine ball thing over here, and I'm three feet short on every shot. And I realized, wow, I don't have a stroke anymore. <laughs> it's funny. It's a good break here. Yeah, it's a pretty good break, but he's actually got a bank at this eight ball if he wants it. He can bank at this eight. I think it pass. I think it'll go in, and he can play his cue ball in the bottom of the stack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Going to the twelve. But they're they're playing they're playing fast pool though. You know what I mean? Where they're not actually taking uh the correct one pocket shots that you know what I mean? Like they're playing fast pool. So yeah. some they're they're taking like ultra aggressive shots. Oh look at this. Yeah. I guess Efren's gonna slow it down, and play some defense now. That's a beautiful <laughs> shot by Efren. By the magician. All right, so I can tell you Fetter's shooting at this one. He's just going to go ahead and bank at this. I mean, that's what they've been doing. They've just been banking at the balls. I mean, you know, not 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 really worried about playing safe or anything. Look at the cue ball. It's almost like this is an exhibition match. <laughs> it is. That's exactly what it is. Yeah, yeah and then yeah. the pocket's big like this, so I think it's it makes it more of a shooting contest, too, when it's big pockets, too, right? Right, right. Right. I kind of like the kick bank right there. Hmm. Well, he gave him a ball. He got it out. I don't think he was trying to. I think he was trying to bank that ball on his side, wasn't he? Yeah. Was, that was a yeah. little far out of the pocket to be just giving it up, wasn't it? Yeah. I thought. Yeah, I think he accidentally made that one. He was trying to protect All that right. three ball. Yeah, but it's not protected though. He can yeah. so he can kick it right now. He can just yeah. soft kick it up to the side rail and let Efren go ahead and kick it to fifteen if he wants. Yeah, see, that's what I'm talking about with those, you know, <laughs> ultra-aggressive yeah, ultra aggressive shots. So, Efren's going to try to steal another game and make Fetter tighten up because, you know, he don't want to take no losses. <laughs> He's trying to put no losses on his record now. <laughs> oh, Efren missed the ball in hand. He missed that ball. How did how that ball went in? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Three railer. I'm yeah. sorry, my southern my southern twang came out when I seen that ball go, and I'm like, man, well, how's that ball go? <laughs> in the in the computer industry, we would call these pockets user friendly. User friendly. I think it's a three ball combo after this on the nine. Maybe. I was just about to say, there's a dead ball up there. Yeah, yeah. seven five nine, but there's a little space in there, so you has to be careful. A little mm -hmm. little tiny gap in between the five nine. Yeah. I don't know if it'll make a difference, but. A little teeny gap in there. If it goes, it'll go to the high side of the pocket, right? Yeah. Oh, no, it went right in the center. Never mind. I don't know what I'm talking about. No, oh, he's got a shot. Man. No, I don't know if he's got a shot. He might have to shoot this four. Yeah. 
Ten ball looks like it's just in the way. What a great camera. Know, he might, camera uh, he shot, may be yeah. able to spin this in. He may be able to. Uh, well, that's a predator he's shooting with. He might be able to spin this ball in. Hmm. Look at this. Wow. <laughs> and then he ends up perfect. Well, I don't know if this is perfect. Can he cut this ball? Yeah, he's left handed. Looks... <laughs> he's he's he, left handed. He's just as good left as he is right. I've seen it. Yeah, this is like uh, even money to make that. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh my god. And then he's playing four rail shape. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> wow. Uh, oh, he's he's still the magician even at seventy years old. How is he? Sixty nine, seventy. Yeah. Well, you know, he's, you know, you know, you know, Efren right-handed is the greatest, and left-handed is the second greatest, right? <laughs> no, I did, I didn't know that. <laughs> uh, oh, he finally, finally did something. He might have to shoot the two ten. The ten mm -hmm. looks like he got a gap, doesn't he? Mm -hmm. Yeah, he got go. Yeah, he is shooting it. So he'll only need two. The ten will sit there for the next ball, won't it? Oh no! Oh. Oh, all right. So he gave Feder a chance. Let me see how many he got right there. Let me see four, seven. Oh, he's gonna get out here, cause he all he has yeah. to do is get to the seven ball, and he'll have eight. So he'll have a chance to run all the way out. Yeah, he's gonna shoot these two balls here first. I think right, fifteen. Yeah, I would. Yeah, I would say he's definitely got to move the fifteen, so the thirteen and the two both go without a combo. Little lazy on the shape there, huh? Ooh. Ooh, okay. Rail to rail shot. Are these hangers? For him, maybe. I, I, they, maybe <laughs> they are. I mean, on big, big pockets. I guess they are. I don't know. Mm hmm. I guess not today. See, I, I already. That's what I'm saying. They, they put that. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I wish they hadn't told him to play fast because I thought I was going to see a real race to three here. <laughs> <laughs> I think I a lot I of the audience don't real... don't even know the one pocket game either this year. There's there's hundreds of people here. Yeah, some people was like, you know what's going on? I heard this. No, I don't know. I'm just I'm just watching. <laughs> and, uh, oh, so you don't even think they know what they're looking at? Yeah, a lot a lot of people here just just to see the legend, you know. Yeah. yeah. And then uh, I think Fedor, Fedor's all that money he made last week. I think it's weighing him down his pocket, so it's too heavy. Right I know. Now. He's getting a little <laughs> sluggish, huh? <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, this puts effort out right here, this eighth ball. That puts the old man on two. Yeah. Now, he still played shape for another ball. <laughs> Just to make sure. <laughs> Is that like snooker? You gotta just play them all out so you miss. <laughs> He's just making sure. He, he probably he probably raked a few without having a full ball count. I've done that before, so I like to shoot an extra two when they're there. All right, here we go. Two to one, Efren. And a good break on that one. That looked yeah, like a, really a, a wow. soft eight ball break. Yeah, they opened up very nicely. But Fedder's got a clean shot at the five. I think he's got a keyhole, doesn't he? Yeah. I mean, he looks like he's uh, looking at a enough. shot. It's that ultra aggressive one pocket right here. I mean, I don't know. Like, I, I, I think I, I don't think Efren is just playing. Uh, I think he's trying to win. <laughs> <laughs> Bow! Fired in another eight now. Well, yeah, that that'll handle this that. race to three. <laughs> <That's right. laughs> that'll that'll certainly handle this race to three. Then you got about 150 people waiting in line. To Why play is he Efren shooting this game? ball? Why is he shooting that ball? Oh, he's just having fun with it now. <laughs> I think he's gonna run the whole rack the way the the way he chose that shot. 
Because you look, the eight was right there. Everything, you got four, five, six balls open. You going to shoot that one? No. <laughs> no, he's trying to run the whole rack. For those of you who are watching, Efren is about to run all 15 balls. He's not going to stop at eight. He's going to go get them all just to show y'all who the real magician is. <laughs> the pocket as big as my head, somebody said. Yeah. Yeah, he ain't, he ain't worried about no eight now. He's trying to get 15. Does 15 and out and pay double? Yeah, you know. <laughs> yeah, you well, know, you know, that ball was dead, the 14, but now he's got to move it, I think. He's got to hit it hard. Why is he shooting the seven, though? Oh, he's shooting. Oh, no, he didn't move. Oh, look what he did. That's uh, the magician, man. He ain't got to move nothing. Yeah. <laughs> Right English. I mean, that, that dude just, just adapts to the conditions like nothing, huh? Uh -huh. Well, he got a little, he fell a little soft on that one, didn't he? Yeah. And he come back around for the six after this. Or does you, he could, just... you could try to overcut it and nick the pile on the way by. Yeah, just come around. I think he's going to come be between the two and eight. No, he did nick it. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Yeah, and he's got that. So you nick the pile, Four, you slow that ball down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Too good. Exhibition. <laughs> oh, they tied up a bit. He didn't want that. He, he wanted to shoot them all, right? I told y'all he wanted, to, he wanted to shoot them all. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he's out of line. He lost it. What's he gonna do now? Now look at this. Oh, no. we got we got a three rail to five now. No, no he can can he, he, he cut the six? He can carry him off the six, and can he carry him off the five and bank it down and make the six that way? No, he just cut it straight in almost. Oh man, yeah. Well, that ends our race <laughs> to three, I guess. Yeah. Efren won it. They let him have it. Uh, yeah. Now the fun that the fun begins. Match. Everybody get to play Efren uh, a game now. I think they're all waiting in line. Yeah. Yeah, it looks like the players had some fun. Hope you guys had some fun watching.